Shannon from the Dell MD Storage Engineering team, and today I'm here to bring you an introduction into remote replication. Remote replication is a premium feature exclusively for the Dell MD3600F series storage array, which allows for the creation of up to 16 replication pairs of virtual disks supported on a storage array. This data can be stored off-site for business continuity purposes. Fiber channel interconnects are used to connect the MD3600F storage arrays through a fiber channel switch. The data is copied dynamically on write operations from the primary virtual disk storage array to the secondary virtual disk in a remotely located MD3600F, whose data is read-only until it is promoted. The replication process can be synchronous or asynchronous. Synchronous means that the write operation is completed to both the primary and secondary virtual disks before the status transfer to the host indicates completion. This method of replication may impact performance over long-distance transmissions within the fabric between the local and remote site. Synchronous replication is recommended for inter-campus replication where the MD3600F sites are less than six miles apart. Asynchronous means that the completion status is returned to the host for I.O. when the write operation to the primary virtual disk is finished. At this time, the write operation is sent via array-to-array -array communications to the secondary virtual disk. This method of replication reduces WAN fabric latency effects on host I.O. performance and enables replication to a remote site a very long distance away. The remote replication process is storage-based, so no host is required and there is no application overhead. It can also be fully integrated with all other Dell Premium features. Remote replication is supported on MD3600F storage arrays with dual RAID controllers, which provides the added redundancy that your business critical data deserves. Remote replication uses port 3 on the MD3600F RAID controller, which is the rightmost fiber channel port for data transfer between storage arrays. Remote replication requires the use of a fiber channel switch for the remote replication ports. There are specific fiber channel fabric switch zoning requirements for communication and data transfer between storage arrays. Please refer to this figure within the guide titled Configuring Fiber Channel with Dell MD3600F Series Storage Arrays to correctly zone your fiber channel switch fabric. This guide can also be found at support.dell.com slash manuals. This concludes your introduction and remote replication. In part two, activation and setup, I will show you how to activate the remote replication premium feature and also how to create a virtual disk replication relationship.